let us consider electric potential energy so what is this electric potential energy simply work done in bringing the charges from infinity to a finite distance of separation imagine two charges are separated by infinity distance say q1 is one charge q2 is another charge separation between them is infinity now i want to bring them from infinity to a finite distance of separation so q2 came to this position q1 came to this position say distance of separation is d so work done in bringing these two charges from infinity to a finite distance of separation is stored in the system as potential energy so that is electric potential energy so normally in the imagining both are brought from infinity let us keep q1 constant at rest this is q2 q2 is only brought whether we move both are keep one at rest and move the second one to a d distance of separation then also the situation is same so what is the work done in this process so let us consider we know that w is equal to difference in potential multiplied by charge mode so what is the potential difference at this point due to this point at infinity let us say this potential is v1 here potential is v2 that means so we are interested in v2 minus v1 into charge mode what is the potential v1 value at infinity potential due to any charge is zero electric field or intensity due to any charge at infinity distance is always zero therefore i can take this as v2 into charge mode q what is the equation for v2 1 by 4 pi epsilon not times q1 by d and the charge mode is q2 so this is what we call potential energy pe is equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon not into q1 q2 by d so from infinity i am assuming two charges are moved such that the final distance of separation is d the work done in bringing these two charges from infinity to this final distance of separation is stored in the system as potential energy that potential energy is given by 1 by 4 pi epsilon not into q1 q2 by d very important point substitute the charges substitute charges along with its sign if it is a positive charge substitute positive if it is a negative charge substitute negative because potential energy may be negative or positive so it is a scalar though it is a scalar work may be negative or positive similarly potential energy may be or negative or positive now suppose if i take two positive charges they are moved towards each other say like this so finally they came to let us say these two positions simply i can say distance between two positive charges decreased d is decreased then what is the effect on potential energy the system potential energy if you observe potential energy is inversely proportional to distance of separation so when they brought together two like charges come closer then potential energy value increases so as the charges come closer potential energy increases that means the stability potential energy more means the stability will be less system is unstable because of this reason to gain more stability always two positive charges they repel each other the repulsion of positive charges is mainly because as the distance increases potential energy of the system decreases and the stability increases in the similar way if i imagine a plus and minus brought closure so let us say 
again these two are moved brought closure then if you take potential energy which is 1 by 4 pi epsilon not into q1 minus q2 by d as d decreases d decreases pe increases with negative sign so negative sign increase means potential energy net potential energy decreases so when a oppositely charge opposite charges are brought nearer then automatically system potential energy decreases that's why stability increases this is the reason why unlike charges attract like charges repel and unlike charges attract because they want to increase the stability as the like charges repel distance increases potential energy decreases so stability increases unlike charges attract as the distance decreases potential energy decreases that means stability increases now suppose if i take a three particle system let us say three charges q1 q2 q3 say d1 d2 d3 three charges q1 q2 q3 are placed at the three corners of a triangle of sides d1 d2 d3 as shown in the figure what is the potential energy of the system so for every pair of charges find the potential energy and then add that means potential energy is now given by first two charges 1 by 4 pi epsilon not q1 q2 by d1 1 by 4 pi epsilon not q2 q3 by d2 plus 1 by 4 pi epsilon not q3 q1 by d3 so here substitute the charge along with its sign so in all these things common factor is 1 by 4 pi epsilon not so it becomes q1 q2 by d1 plus q2 q3 by d2 plus q3 q1 by d3 suppose d1 is equal to d2 is equal to d3 is equal to d equilateral imagine it is an equilateral triangle then potential energy becomes 1 by 4 pi epsilon not 1 by d times q1 q2 plus q2 q3 plus q3 q4 so important point substitute charge along with its sign substitute charge with the sign if it is plus substitute plus sign. if it is minus minus then only you will get the correct answer